tell our listeners what's going to be happening um, and when. What are you going to be doing and when? All right. Well, uh, back, you know, back in October, we had done a very long, extensive, or started a very long, extensive 24-7 presence down near Curtis Hickson Waterfront um, on the sidewalk. Well, you know, we had a lot of public support back then, and, um, and we just want to refresh that support, you know, let them know so that people can see what we're still doing, what we're, you know, the community gardens and the different things that we've gotten accomplished. And, you know, it's kind of a call out to the other organizations as well in the area to, uh, to, to help in maintaining that presence because of a lot of problems we face still. So you were in front of Curtis Six and Park on Ashley Drive, but there's a lot of construction down there now. Mm -hmm. Are you going to be in the same location? Um, we're actually going to be in front of Bank of America for the um, five days. 24-7, you know, um, it's going to be May 23rd through the 28th, and um, we're going to stay there 24-7, and if we have to, we can always still go sleep on the sidewalk over at Curtis Hickson, because that's still open, but um, but we plan on staying at Bank of America as long as we won't run into interference. So, In the fall, the sidewalk was kind of the agreed upon place between you and the police where the occupiers could sleep, but there was, there was still harassment by the police, or... or um, there was still, you know, the, the occupiers felt that there was harassment by the police and there were even some arrests on that sidewalk. Do you think that you risk harassment or arrest this time? Well, with Occupy, you always risk harassment, but I don't think we're going to risk uh, arrest this time because we've already gone through the court cases of 22-8. Uh, they just dropped all of them um, because they, you know, they said that people aren't objects. You can't remove a person from, the, you know, they, they don't count as an object on the sidewalk. So. So they don't really have grounds to arrest us, especially on Curtis Hickson. It's a wide enough sidewalk to where we don't impede the sidewalk. So um, at the Bank of America sidewalk, it, it might not be wide enough. We're, that's the kind of things we're going to have to check to see, you know, where what we can get away with there. But you know, we plan on being accordingly and, and doing staying out of trouble. So, and if people want to find out <coughs> more information um, or join you, where can they go to get more information? Um, well, we have an, a, face, a Facebook event page. Um, it's called the uh, Five. Five day protest at Curtis Six and Sidewalk. Um, you can look it up on Facebook, and um, you can, yeah, this, you can also look up probably on Occupy Tampa. I'm, I'm going to get it passed to the General Assembly for them to support it. So I'm sure they'll have the event as well there. And do you think that there's going to be uh, how many people? Uh, well, so far, uh, I, this morning when I checked, we had about 13 people for that were going to be there 24 seven for the five days, and we had somewhere around 20 people that we're gonna be there as often as possible. So, um, you know, I only posted it yesterday, so hopefully we'll have a lot.